in this video, I'm going to show you how to change your screen size in OBS Studio. So there's a few different methods that we can use to go and change the screen size. Now, the first method is just by going and selecting your source like so. And then you should see this red border around the preview. And what you can do is just go and drag the edges of this preview to make a selection of the screen that you want to record. Now, this is always going to resize the screen in its aspect ratio. But if you just wanted to drag the right or the left side, for example, then what you can do is hold down the shift key on your keyboard and then you can go and move the edges either to the left or the right. You can also right click somewhere on this screen, click on transform and then you can press reset transform to go and reset back to its original default. Now you can also right click again and click on transform and you have a few more different options here such as rotating the screen or you can flip the screen horizontally or vertically. If you just want to make this full screen you can always right click, click on transform and make sure this is set to fit to screen. Now another thing you can do here is go and convert this landscape video into a portrait video. Now the way you would do that is by coming over to file in the top navigation, click on settings, in the left hand side select video and here you'll find your base and output resolution. Now what you need to do is reverse these two numbers here. So currently this is in landscape format which is 16 by 9 but if I go and change this to 1080 by 920 you can see it reverses the aspect ratio to 9 by 16 and you also want to do the same for the output as well so I'm going to reverse these two numbers and then go and press apply and OK and now as you can see this has changed the recording to a portrait video and then just like before I can go and move and reposition my screen here in the preview and that's it guys if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one